Hello everyone, welcome back to The Cradle. Uh, we are in Season 2 and I am playing in the Chromatic Team. Uh, so I will be playing today against... What is it called? I think Red Dead Redemption? Something like that. Oh, Red Dead Ridiculous. Because, same thing. Which is an orc team, so it's going to be kind of interesting because this is a team that was developed last season. So I'm probably going to get hurt a little bit. Uh, hopefully not a lot. <clears throat> but also means that I get to have some inducements, which could be good. So we're waiting for my uh, uh, person I'm playing with to log in. Um, I went for a more agility based team, so I have two werewolves, two whites, two ghouls, and the rest are zombies. Uh, werewolves are amazing because they have claw and frenzy. Uh, once I get blocked on these two, it will really be part of what I think the core of this team is. Um, whites are really good just because they're the way they are, and ghouls are obviously good for the same uh, reason they kind of built up um, what exactly this team is. <clears throat> so, oh, yeah. let's hear message. Him. <clears throat> oh, yeah, since we haven't really gone through the league. Oh, won't have time for that. So it is a very sunny day in California. It is quite warm, and I think I should not have had soup because it is quite warm. Uh, but you know, I will just have to live with that <coughs> as I am sweating. <clears throat> uh, so this much gold, I have the option of getting a star player. Uh, I think they're all out of... Um, <clears throat> I don't think it's worth getting this guy. Uh, pretty good. Alright, well let's, let's, let's make sure I get some basics down. Because I feel as though I will need uh, a wizard. Oh. oh, that puts me exactly the amount. Um, yeah, we might have to do this. Uh, I really, really, really should have some brews, but <clears throat> um, we're gonna have to probably go with this. <laughs> it's, uh, it is a bit risky to be going with a star player and no rerolls. I oh, I don't feel like extra rerolls in this group or this. Oh no, no. Okay, cool. Uh, it was crashing. Um, I don't feel as though extra rules are going to affect this game as much as me needing to come back during the uh, halves with uh, babes, but or star power really. The um. <clears throat> Blood Bowl channel is happy to bring you this match, which if it lives up to expectations, should be a real oh. humdinger, shouldn't it, Jim? Hi, Bob. Hi, everyone. My answer would be like every Blood Bowl match. Blood, sweat, tears, a bull, apothecaries on standby. What more can you ask for? Apparently, the coach isn't too sure about oh. that. He knows it's going to be a massacre. He just doesn't know how many players he'll have left at the end of the match. So they decided to put Swalter Heat in the game, just like it is outside the game. Yay. Um. Oh. 
Oh, I really hope my star player can do the business. Like, where, where the F is he? I wish I went for Bruce instead of the, the wizard. But we'll see how this works out. Um, Alright, so I'm receiving, so I want. Did you hear about the evil Gits? The team that is made uh, up of the mix of evil players? Their fans won the most evil supporters of the year award. Fully married, from what I've seen. Our player in the front. <clears throat> um. Are yeah, they block? Alright, so he doesn't have blocks. I'll swap him out. I think I feel good with this. And look who's stepping onto the pitch. Wow! <coughs> a veritable Blood Bowl legend. And what am I then? A venerable Blood Bowl legend. Mm. <laughs> um. Come on, this. Catch it. Why didn't you catch it? Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Alright, so he has block. Um. Now, orcs have always gone for a power game. <clears throat> you have to realize that it was only recently that they discovered the purpose of the ball during a match. Alright, that, that's fine. I mean, we're still moving this guy away, so... God, they all have block! Alright, um... Move you here... They can start to move forward. All right, cool. Um, I don't really think I should move up for full movement, but <clears throat> I need to be a little bit. Okay. Um, Over there, some cute little elf beauties are selling big moot sandwiches in That's the stand. Risky, but... hey, I'm off to get one. I'll be back in five minutes. And so now you like big moot sandwiches? That's no way. A little elf beauty? Yeah. I think she's singing a oh. lullaby. Um. Yeah. Uh. I'm not gonna cast my wizard. For those of you who don't know how wizards are played, uh, you can go over to here. Where the f- is it here? Oh, here it is. It's- well, like, it's not my turn. Um, but this one lets you activate the wizard on your turn. Wizards are good for kind of taking the ball out of their hands or knocking down a group of their guys. <clears throat> Ouch! 
sure he's knocked them senseless. You're assuming, then, that he had something between his ears to begin with. Other movements. Four, five... <coughs> hmm. So I could get past them? I've heard of teams that have simply disappeared after being abandoned by their supporters. I'm just, Let's say that some one, teams one, two, who three, haven't won a match four, for several five, years six, have been tied up by their fans I'm and like thrown two into rubbish containers. From it's the only way to end a down having a touchdown. Oh, that sucks. From having a touchdown? <clears throat> Looks like the star player has taken a sudden interest in the state of the pitch. Well, someone will be taking a sudden interest in his head if he doesn't come round pretty quickly. So much block. So much block. So, the reason I'm not blitzing with my werewolves is because I feel as though I'm going to need them in the second half. I don't want to take a chance at them getting knocked down on my ball possession. Um, Wizards have not always been able to cast spells safely from behind the sidelines. Were you playing at the time in an Albion League, a second division that prohibited spellcasting from off the pitch? Oh yes, they were great times. I remember fans traveling to games just to see how well Wizards stood up to the mad charge of a raving Blood Bowl star. The noise created by a sizzling fireball, followed by the characteristic sound of the snapping of a wizard's neck. So this actually might be a good start off point. I want to get him up, but I want to get him up and tackle this guy. But that requires me to break through here. Alright, well, I'm probably going to have to... This is going to decide whether I re-roll. Okay. <clears throat> what wow, he still can't. Yes. Oh, it's God. a great spectacle, uh, Bob. Right, well, he's gonna keep them busy. Alright, that's what I needed. Yes, it should have technically knocked him down. Do you remember when the first necromantic him... teams started to appear in the minor circuits, Bob? Oh yeah, that sure was fun, Jim. Um. Especially when they fielded skeletons and werewolves at the same time, Bob. <laughs> <laughs> I remember the werewolves kept running away with the skeleton's bones, much to the delight of the fans. <laughs> I don't know if he really liked that uppercut. He may not have liked it, but he certainly ate it. Oh, excuse me. 